new what it do is your girl Kiki Kiara what's up I have some new lights and I have a background now so I am really excited to see what this video looks like turns out like and I'm very excited for you guys to see it because now it looks more professional it looks like I know what I'm doing and I do not know what I'm doing but it looks like I do so that's dope I am just gonna do another makeup tutorial I really didn't like how my first one ended up because it was like 1 in the morning when I was filming so the lighting was very bad I was really tired didn't know what I was doing and the makeup was really bad too so not saying that the makeup today is gonna be any better because I don't know but I'm hoping it will I'm just gonna do a really simple look basically like my everyday makeup I guess also please deal with me on this my eyebrows are really uneven and hairy this one's curved this one's straight I have been growing them out because I'm gonna do them right before school starts which is next week <laughs> but I have been growing them out so when I do my eyebrow makeup today they're gonna be really bad we just got to deal with it we got to be strong for Kiara's brows so let's just start this so I just use the Anastasia dip brow like every other basic girl in the world and I put some on my brush and I always uh this helps a lot if your brush is kind of crusty like mine is because my life is a complete mess I just kind of like squeeze it to kind of make it thinner if that makes sense I hope that makes sense I'm just gonna brush them up wow they really are hairy guys I am so proud of this I actually uh shaved them like I always do a few weeks ago but I really messed up and they're really thin they look like you know novelas, like the moms in the novelas, and they have tattooed eyebrows on. They're like really uh, thin, and they're turning green because of the ink. <laughs> That's honestly what my eyebrows look like, so I'm a little blessed right now because at least they don't look that bad. Also, I'm very surprised that this camera doesn't look that bad because I'm just using the front camera on iPhone 6S. Not bad. bars notes oh god <laughs> oh jesus oh my days <laughs> so this summer was probably my busiest summer yet which was surprising i did not expect that usually most summers i just stay and hang like with my family and just do barbecues and we did do that again this year but i actually hung out with people which is something i never do because people are lame and so I'm trying to remember what I didn't order. I went to Hawaii. That was fun. I miss Hawaii so much. Hawaii was so dope. Like it was so hot that I was sweaty all the time. So I didn't even need to put highlight on because I had a natural glow going on. But I'm extra, so I still did put highlight on. So I just looked like a bread roll from Texas Roadhouse, which was nice because I like looking like a bread roll from Texas Roadhouse. And my hair just got a lot healthier. Like, I don't know how that even works, but it does. And I'm just so thankful for Hawaii for even existing. And so my eyebrows are done. So the next step would just be eyeshadow. And my eyeshadow for this look is just really easy. I just use a little brown shadow I have. And my baby broke. Like me, I'm broke too. <laughs> but yeah, it's broken, so that sucks. And I just grab some brown and I just rub it on both my eyelids. Literally like the easiest look ever. So I basically just blended that all over my eyelids. And that was it. Also, um, it's really hard for me to wash mascara off. Well, like, it's not hard, but I'm really lazy. So I kind of have like several years of accumulated mascara on my eyelashes, so they're really crusty and hard and dry. And I know I should probably wash them and take care of that. I will eventually, but for now, I've just been layering mascara on old mascara for a while. So once I'm done putting on my 500 coats of mascara, I jump right into foundation. So. I already moisturized and primed my skin, so I'm just going to put foundation on. This foundation is the best foundation I've ever bought, and it's just Maybelline Fit Me. 
Matt and Poor Lewis Foundation. Now, this is so dope. Best drugstore foundation in the world. Super dope. I have a Kat Von D foundation. And honestly, this is way better than this. And this is like $55 and this is like $8. So, life, what you doing? You know, buy this instead of buying this. So I just use a brush I got from Home Depot, or it could have been Lowe's, I don't know, but I do have a discount code for Lowe's, um, Kiki Builds Sheds 57, so you could use that for a 1.75 off your next purchase at Lowe's or Home Depot, I don't know which one. And no, this is not sponsored. This is not a sponsored video, you know. I'm so stupid. Oh my gosh. So, um, I started watching The Office. I'm only like, you know, what, 10, 9 years late. And it is the best show ever. It is my favorite show. Oh my gosh. So, I started watching it on Netflix and I was hooked from like the first two seconds. And it is just a masterpiece. It is art. It is beautiful. It's the best show of all shows and I'm already on season six and there's only nine seasons and I'm really excited to start all the seasons over again and keep watching them until I die okay so yeah keep uh, I'm still gonna talk about the office so literally Pam and Jem are like relationship goals and I'm so obsessed with them and I really hate that one episode where, wait, what was the episode? I don't know, I think, like, Jim told Pam, right, that he, like, confessed his love, and she's like, I'm with Roy, or, like, I don't know, like, oh my god, I forgot what it was, but something happened, and you know, they've been through so much, and I just get so triggered, because one of them is dating, and then the other one is single, and then one of them, like, the other one's dating, and then the other one's single, and I just really wanted them to be together, and Pam and Jim were together, and they just had their, did I just say Pam and Jen? I meant Jim. And, oh my gosh. I was so excited when Pam and Jim got together. Like, I cried real tears. I, my tears were so real. And they just had their baby. Cecilia. Cece's so cute. Now I'm just gonna concede. Eh, concede. <laughs> now I'm gonna conceal. Now, the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer is the best concealer I've ever bought. It's so dope and so cheap. I think it's like $7. Okay, so I just put concealer on my forehead, under my eyes, underneath my cheekbones, my chin. Some people put concealer on their nose too, but like... Look at how huge my nose is. It's thick. My nose is thick. You know what I used to be obsessed with watching was WWE, and I'd watch it all the time. And obviously John Cena was my favorite just because he had the dopest song. But I also liked The Undertaker, and The Undertaker would literally pull up on the ring and freaking, uh, what's it called? He would like drink water and spit it on the audience, and then he'd roll his eyes back. He was just so dope. I was a fan of The Undertaker. Also, this Lorac palette that I'm like holding right now is so dope. Alyssa got it for me for my birthday, so shout out to Alyssa. You're so real. And I love this so much because the shadows are cute, but like the highlight is literally my life. I've never had setting powder before, and I actually bought this last week, and so I was really excited when I got it because it was my first time using it. So I don't know. I don't know if this is good compared to like other loose powders, but this one seems to be working well for me, so whatever. I remember, like, just a few years back when I was in middle school and stuff, I didn't know how to do makeup, and I would watch YouTube videos on people doing makeup, and I would be like, wow, those girls are so stupid. Why do they put on so much makeup and, like, all that powder? Like, they look like clowns. They're so dumb. And now look at me. Like, I'm a freaking mess, so. I just wish I could, actually no, I was going to say I wish I could go back to middle school to like fix my makeup, but I hated middle school so much. 
Middle school was like the worst two years of my life, honestly. I was just so stupid and my makeup was so bad. My personality was trash. I just thought I was the coolest person ever. And like when I say cool, I mean like cool. Like I thought I was cool and that everybody else was lame and that I was like a queen. <laughs> Did you hear that sound I made with my, <laughs> what the heck, Kiara? But yeah. And I just, I don't know. I was like really shy too. And I was like really scared to just participate in class and stuff like that. And I just, I just wish that I could fix that, but I can't. But today I'm cool, and I'm not like that anymore. And now we wait. I don't know how long it's supposed to take me to bake. And I don't know what I'm doing, because I've never really done this before. So now we're just going to sit and wait. And hope that something is happening to my face to make me look beautiful. Okay, so um, it's been a couple hours, so I'm just going to dust this off. Just kidding, it hasn't been a couple hours. I think it's been like two minutes. Now, I know I look a little pale, but I just checked a mirror in front of my window, and like in natural light, my makeup actually does not look this pale, so that was cool. Now more mascara. So for bronzer, I don't have any good bronzers. I have the Kat Von D shade and light palette, like the thing uh, wore off, but yeah, but girl had the pen. She kind of ran out. This color right here, this shade was so dope for bronzer. It was like the best bronzer I've ever owned, but I use it all. And these powders are really good too, so. I've just been mixing all three of these to kind of create like the right bronzer color for me. Sometimes it ends up good, sometimes it doesn't. So, I definitely gotta buy a bronzer. So, after I'm done with bronzer, I'll just put some blush on. So, using this Lorac palette, this bronze I mean, not bronzer, this blush color is so dope. I just love that color. Because most of my blushes are, like, really light, and this one's kind of dark. It's cool. Oh, secret. I don't know where blush is supposed to go. And all I just know it's not supposed to go in a circle right here because then I look like a clown. So I just kind of like blend it right over my bronzer, but I don't know. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing right now. Look it up. Now my favorite part, which is highlighting. I'm going to mix the uh, Becca Shimmering Skin Perfector in Opal, which is my baby, with this uh, Laura palette, the highlighter I was talking about. That was really dope. It's like really light. I had a highlighting brush and I lost it a few weeks ago. I don't know where it is. That was tragic. Ooh, look at that glow. I am living for this glow right now. Look at that. Nice. And then I'll grab the lighter highlighter and I'll just put that, um, what's it called? Underneath my brows. And then on the bridge of my nose and I'm not gonna put any on the tip because I like how it looks but my nose is huge and it's kind of made my nose look better bigger so yikes so I'm almost done guys last step is just lining my lips now I put lipstick on or lip gloss on top but I don't have any nice ones yet I just have a lip liner for now so that's what I'm gonna use No, you should probably never, like, 
fill in your whole lip with lip liner because they'll get really dry, but I'm a savage, so you're a savage. You can do that. And I'm done, guys. I'm done with my makeup. Check it out. Okay, so that's it for this makeup look. It was a little... I think it was better than my last one, and this makeup is a lot more natural and simple than my past looks because this summer I wore a lot of fake lashes and a lot of crazy eyeshadows, but I like this. This is what I would wear every day. This is probably what I'm going to wear for school. And yeah, this is dope, and I'm really excited to see what this video ended up like with the background and everything. Hopefully everything was cool. So yeah, just be sure to hit that thumbs up, hit that subscribe button. Hit that subscribe button right now. You know those memes where it's like, the gun and it says like love yourself right now. Subscribe yeah. right now. Slap the bell to get notified. <laughs> oh yeah, slap the bell to get notified. So that's it for today. Um, it's actually not it for today because I think I'm gonna make another YouTube video with my brother, and that will be up too. So that video should be up soon. Yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Oh, also, I forgot a really important step, guys, which was setting your makeup. So I'm just gonna do that. Okay, and that's it. So, face is set, and now I'm done, I promise. See ya.